And allow the new manager to have these like that with three games no coming up questions. I wonder after if the international be too play. Proud. I never made it, but I know how it takes. I'm motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing, go out of this world. Mission 
So, I think we're staring down the barrel already that the league is over. I never made it, but I know what it takes. I'm motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing go. Saying about you know when he was manager in Sevilla and Valencia um, and he, he had some you know some good uh, finishes but Sevilla Sevilla regressed under him under him they, they went slowly backwards and, and the fans the fans don't like him it. it's because he was very negative he set up to stop the other team playing as well at Sevilla and he had David Villa at one point in time and uh, you know it's a very good team that he there. And, and once they got rid of he lost those players, they were blessed. And they were finished in And I, I just, I don't know what else to say, but I, I don't really, I really don't want to say he'll slag him off because he's a 
a nice guy, but he's just, he's just a poor All of our players were elite. All of our players were aggressive and positive. And it's still very hard to do. Absolutely got to take a lot of responsibility for themselves. The fact that I mean I've never ever in my entire life I've never seen a team equalise in the 96 minute and the whole round was quiet at home. And even the coach was completely motionless. Well, that is just a, a very, very surreal thing to have happened. And even, like I said, didn't even didn't celebrate the goal. And that's just the, I mean, that's just the shock wave. And that's just the same shock wave for everyone who witnessed that. Because the players seem to be down there. And that's just the one 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 that's And it, I it's cannot believe that nothing is being done and it's just being allowed to continue. The fact that we're seven is, my God, more it's more just more shocking. We're going to be in a well, relegation type of business if it doesn't go. And that's simple. Tottenham were 14th at the start of the day and if they won by three million goals, they were three million ahead, they would jump to fifth. And we're going to go down, we're not going to get the win. We're not gonna win against Norwich, Norwich is one away against Everton. They're gonna be the win. It's just a joke. It's just a world to say. Started then, you know, he's, he, he's but just, you know, the wrong job. I suppose they don't want to do it at the moment because it, doing. it may now, be a bit of. It's not his fault. I don't know. Career suicide. It, in some ways, it's some people have to choose not to employ their services because they don't like what they've done. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I mean, if they all went, if they literally all got up and said, "Look, you know, it's something to be done." Then they should have hopefully done that in the changing room today. They should have had a, a long, lengthy conversation and just put it all out in the open, everything. Whether that's happened, I don't know. Hopefully it's getting announced it tomorrow. But the way things are going, I think it's going to be nice. It's not going to be on the end of the season. It's going to be so successful. Sweeper for Christ's sake, you know it. It's just ridiculous. 
I just don't know where else to go. And that midfield, everyone knows that that midfield is just it does not work. Terrell uh, and Gwendouzi together, it's just not dynamic enough. And they're bit, I just love to know what they've been told to do on the pitch. They end up all over the place. And I said, I said to my son, I'm watching it, my son, and they're there. That's a bit of easy place in the team. But if it weren't for me, they wouldn't know what they would have gone to Aston Villa or someone else with all their mates or Aston Villa. from here and what we do and uh, listening to other podcasts and I think it was on Guns and Yellow also as well that, um, we're talking about I never made it but I know I did take some motivated by a mix of emotion got my statement and I'm reading slow so I can understand it fully appreciate my standing go out of this world and dry they're, they're going to be supporting Liverpool and Man City and Chelsea, aren't they? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Well, it's uh, the, the scary thing is the one one big shining light in the park at the moment are the young players, and they're being they're being destroyed on the pitch. And they're, they're, you can see it before your eyes. You know, they're, they've got the same player that they were. You know, it's the and the confidence. Really tender stage of their career, whether it's like, and it could ruin them potentially if nothing happens. And that's the. Uh, I mean, people like, like Martinelli and Quindizi are uh, the, the, the gems in our crown. So they're the only positive thing we've got. And God knows what's going to happen if they. Because, um, uh, like I said, I've said it a couple of weeks ago, the Vultures are going to be searching for Andrew and Beauty and the Martin and the Vinci people not straight away. And we're coming up to January, and we're potentially going to lose the, you know, several players. And we, people have been saying that the extension of what's back at the Jets to go. Um, Terrera, what's up to the Jets? But who's those two? What kind of defense do they have left? And who's the what kind of what top players are playing? Come it's a lot of choice between joining up or supporting the top, for example, in the What you want to do You know, it's no contest, is it, at the moment? And it never used to be that way. Occasion. You would like to think that it will at not least. get to that point. And, uh, but you yeah, show obviously with the board, I mean, I look at Raul. Successful football. Uh, like they are. I never so made it. Made it. Okay. But I know I did take some of it. I am mixed up in motion. Got my statement. And I'm reading slow. So I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing. Go out of this world. And right on time.
think I'll last a bit longer Find another reason to breathe this air And that we made for ourselves This won't be the last time I've never in my life ever seen the sky light up like this I'm far away from Earth and I wanna know if you exist Thanks very much for listening Absolutely no doubt for the players. It is the challenging the, the third in the table at the moment under a big six coach. And I, I, I don't care what anyone says. If, it, if we were still under the Arsenal Bender, we wouldn't have only won two out of the last of any game. I don't think anyone put their hand on their heart and say, we would have only won two out of the last 11. If it's one of the games that we've had, it's been to these guys. I'm not saying I want you back. But that wouldn't have been the case, would it? To be honest. Exactly. We're, we're bad, bad in the dress right? Bad in the dress And it's just uh, shocking. Absolutely shocking that it's still in. People think, people keep saying to throw it in your face, saying, well, it's still early days and you've picked up the mess from Venga, blah, 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 blah. I, I'm sorry, but it's last season, right? And, and I, I've said this before about uh, that Leicester. People keep saying that we've gone through really difficulties with our work. And um, I think it's Emery himself who said that when he had that. to deal with. Last year, Leicester City lost their fucking owner in a helicopter crash right above their stadium, landed in their car park. Alright, and they still came to the area in February, and it's taken him less than nine months, well, it took him far less than that, because by the end of the season they started winning all the last games, I think they won that. I don't know, I think it's back to something, but six of the last seven or something like that, but he was extremely cool. These things are looking at him. And he joined that one in the Premier League. And no one would have said his last season, knowing the Arsenal players were getting that level of points, and he's still up there. Someone needs to go in there and give them a good shake and, and say, what the hell is going on? And, and not just to the players, to the Raoul with Edu who walked into that dressing room and they walked out and still giving his back. But what the hell? What? This isn't Arsenal. You can't be allowed to go on. It's just beyond a joke. Beyond a joke. And I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, what to say. And I've got a horrible feeling that it's going to happen in the whole season. That's the case, we're going to be lucky to survive. Uh -oh. If I'm so deep, I'm going to We can take the league in any every game that we can. Are we going to hold on to that league in any way? And we're not going to give you away from the league, but we're going to be uh, victorious. We're going to be away. We were lucky to come away with that. Thing, 
no this. way. We're not going to win a, a, and if a we game in that either. Our manager and uh, it's allow just the new manager very sad. I just don't know what to say, really. Games coming up after the international break. I never made it, but I know I did take some motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing go out of this world. Remove that so one issue. I'm not so, I'm, like I've said under time. It's not. I don't put everything all into memory, made it, but uh, I think but the I biggest part of the journey are it, it, it all stems from here. Like the, the captain's team, playing players out, so the they're changing the formation every single week, they're changing the personnel every week. It's not healthy. No other team would do that in the top five leagues around Europe. And people said that I don't know what any strategy is. Well, I know what strategy is. And he gave us a big clue when he first joined the club when he made about the third That his strategy is purely to change so that teams don't recognise us from one week to another. He thinks he's being smart by changing the formation and setting up the the players and to counteract that the opposition. How they're going to play against us week to week? He's going to ban all of them because they don't enough to know who, what formation we're going to play. What we're going to play. What we're going to play. And he thinks he's being clever doing that. And it's just to 
I'm just thinking you might do when you play FIFA or something, you're not even lying. Like and then no, no other manager in the top five leagues would do something so stupid. You know, you need continuity to build up a team bond, team ethics, and get confidence in the way you, you play. You need a unique play, so no particular play, whatever particular play, right back, play over the game. And it can feel settled and build relationships with those around them. They've got to have to do that. And this really is the team that you can trust that. And that means it's just philosophy. So you can gain your position. That all you want is stop and score. But you know that if they don't score, you don't need to gain. And it helps that you're a mixer. That is it. And people have got to realise that. And it's... It's got to change from oh, game to game. That, that's whoever we put in charge, it doesn't matter. We've got to get out of this rut because otherwise it would be far too late. Because once, you, know it's, you know, for the sake winning is a habit, but I'm afraid losing is a habit as well. If we get into that spot, it's very, very hard to get out of. Because if we're getting away with draws on there, and you all know that we don't deserve that draw today, we should have been beaten. And we're very lucky, and it's not going to last long. If you continue to give teams 20 plus shots against you every match, then one, one win, one team is going to have one of those games where every team they, they strike goes in. And we're going to get fucked in four, four, five, six. Because that's the law of average. They're not always going to miss those shots that they have on our goals. One team is going to be bumping from you. That would just be breaking for an awful lot of these players. I'll tell you, the luck, our luck was having that that would be a bit that we had a lot of young players in the team that so that happened to us. They get bumped and, and their confidence would just be shot to pieces. And um, it's coming. It is. Everyone would have said that there'd be no it, it, the, All the statistics point that way. That we are not going to get this luck in for much longer. They're going to get a draw out of the game. And we're going to start losing and losing and losing. And it's going to get even worse. Because we haven't hit rock bottom yet, unfortunately. Um, but it's not too far around the corner. Only three or four weeks ago, so that we were third, maybe maybe four or five weeks ago, we were third, and we, and we had a good a good to see us. But we think we're, we're, it's going to change that quickly, so we're going to start winning every week and try and overhaul the, the league. I don't, I don't think we can. If you, if the reason to breathe this air, and now we may. Mission control, am I drifting? Time is 
Yeah, he's, he, he's just day. in a, he's in a wrong to job. To take advantage it's a of that and win the game. Him. He ain't got a clue what he's doing. You know, because now, then, if we don't win on Thursday, I never made it. But I know I did take some motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing low. See where my negativity is coming from at the moment. We do, if, we, if we don't do anything and change, don't change the manager. Podcast, we are seriously going to be in, in the dire straits. I never made it, but I, I, I don't want to go into it's January. And then, yeah, fighting off the box. I am mixed up Breathe 
And uh, yeah, show them that we yeah, want points, to see successful yeah. football. I never made it, but I know I it takes. I'm motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading the slip so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing, go out of this world.
I think I'll last a bit longer Fine Another reason to breathe this air And now we may for ourselves This won't be the last time Alright, three Changed our manager and allowed the new manager to have yeah, these I so. I, I, I three games I coming up with that so, uh, after the international really break. I never made it, but I know I did it. Yeah, I'm motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement, and I'm reading the slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing, go out of this world and ride on time.
but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. Yeah, really no. Do, so we haven't already do subscribe. I think we're like staring that. down the barrel already. Yeah. yeah. That the league is over. I never made it, but I know I did take some motivated by a mix of emotion. Got my statement. Yeah. And I'm reading slow so I can understand it fully. Appreciate my standing go. Tell me.